I must address you today, not just as your president, but as the shining beacon of hope and brilliance that I've become. When I launched my run for office, it was simply to show the world what true leadership looks like, even though I meant it as a joke. The nation was in dire need of my genius, my wit, and my unparalleled charm. Despite my best efforts to make myself unelectable by being as offensive and insulting as possible, you saw through it all. You recognized greatness when you saw it, and your support only grew. The worse I acted, the more you adored me. You knew, as I knew, that only I could truly lead this nation to unparalleled glory. My opponents, they lost their minds, discrediting themselves with their screaming and screeching. They couldn't handle my brilliance, my flair for the extraordinary. And so, I won the primaries, and I accepted the mantle of your chosen leader. And then I won the presidency. Hard to believe. Not for me. My talents are endless, my vision clear. I'm here to make this country not just great, but spectacular in my own unique way. Who knows, perhaps it will turn out more than okay. With me at the helm, how could it not? So here's my apology. I'm sorry that I didn't step up sooner. I'm sorry that you had to wait this long for true leadership. Together, we'll make history.